sure about later. <laughs> it's just like... I know, it's like a little alien. Yeah, it's totally alien. <laughs> Yeah. 
So, but I think those are the two big things yeah. that are perceived, are perceived as being uh, sorry, um, festive. Yeah. And then the more, you know, something like, oh, this is a special time of year. Let's, yeah. get, let's spend a little more money yeah, on for the sure. our selection. So. And what about port? Do you notice any, like, fortified wines moving over the holidays? I know port seems to be a, kind of a fixture in a lot of well, people's houses. But I think people are more likely during the holidays to have a more well-rounded meal. So yeah. they start, like, so they'll have something to start with, yeah. they'll have their bottle of wine, and then they'll finish with something. Right. I find that port is, sells the least out of our dessert, uh, or finishing, which is oh, really? And sherry is starting to move too. So people are, are trying to start with sherry. sherry. Yeah. Well, we had some now. amazing restaurants open in the city, uh, Spanish and uh, Bar Isabel started. Now there's uh, Bar Rebel. Yeah. And they have nice extensive selection sherry. of sherry and they yeah. really pushed that like yeah. there were people before them but that's that really started push. so we have like even here we have probably more than you would expect but yeah um yeah that's actually surprising so we tend to sell things that are more um we have aromatic things like this uh we have this beautiful honey there's a honey wine producer right in Quebec oh that makes these amazing um Honey wines, it doesn't call them meat because they're so elegant for so many people. And they're, and they're dry, but we have one of the dessert wines and it has this amazing level of acidity on it. So it has this beautiful caramelized, it looks caramelized, uh, it has this fresh, fresh, fresh acidity on it. Um, so it's kind of it's different than pork that way. It's, it's, it's not like they, people are like, yeah, they'll keep going back. They're like, you sip and they want to blow. Yeah, it's not really. Cool. Like, yeah. yeah. So. Yeah. Sort of a go-to for people when they don't want to think. 
Yeah. I'm always like on each other's. Yeah. It's actually a little bit, it's not, uh, it's still got fruit on it. Yeah. It's not um, sweet. Yeah. Prosecco can be a little soft and sweet. Yeah. So yeah, it's definitely good. very dry. Yeah. I still love what you do it. Yeah. The red fruit flavor. And you're not supposed to overanalyze it. You're supposed to just throw it back and then have another I can get on board with that. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you, Annette, so much for joining me. Thanks, Tim. Um, this, we've been at Midfield Vines. Of course, I'll put all of their information down in the description box below. It'll also be on my Instagram. Um, 